Rep. Marjorie Taylor Greene, Republican Georgia, is refusing to take ownership of a text message she wrote in January 2021 about Donald Trump declaring martial, sick, law to stay in office. But she also doesn't see what the big deal is anyway, she made clear on Thursday. Video footage shows Green tearing into CNN's Jim Acosta on Thursday as he questioned her about the text she sent to then White House Chief of Staff Mark Meadows regarding martial law, she misspelled the term, just prior to Joe Biden's 2021 inauguration. The text was recently obtained by CNN. First, Green insisted to Acosta that she didn't recall those being my text messages. She also claimed in a press conference not to recall the identities of the House members advocating for martial law. She then insisted Acosta read the text message that she claimed she didn't remember sending, succinctly quoting it, I do not know on those things. I don't know if that's my text message or not, but if you want to talk about a text message, read the text message," she later told him. Why even bring it up? Acosta asked her, referring to martial law. You know what your problem is? You're just another one of those liars on television," Green said, not answering the question. I'm not the one saying, I don't recall, Acosta told her. The text poses more bad news for Green, whose right to run for re-election is being challenged by a group of Georgia voters backed by the voters' rights group Free Speech for People. They're citing the 14th Amendment's prohibition on insurrectionists holding office. In a hearing in the case last week, Green said repeatedly that she couldn't remember making statements that hundreds of thousands of people have seen her make on TV, on Facebook and on Twitter. The voter's attorney Andrew Chelly Jr. said her responses stretched credulity, and that he found them shocking.